in the Coors Battle of Champions up next, John. This should be really a banger. Uh, Paul Madison with 20 wins and uh, 17 knockouts. Obviously, he's got a big punch. Dino Holmesy with not nearly as impressive a record, only six wins and one loss, but he has fought some good people, and he's a young guy that really we, we expect a lot from. I don't... All right, let's go to ring announcer Rich Beal for the call on tonight's combatants. Ladies and gentlemen, a five-round bout in the heavyweight division. Introducing first in the blue corner, from Dallas, Texas, a 26-year-old that stands 5 feet 11 inches tall. He weighed in at 194 pounds. His kickboxing record is 20 wins, 4 losses, no draws. 17 of his wins have come by knockout. He is the ISKA's number three world-ranked boxer, a cruiserweight contender. Welcome, please, Paul Madison. Madison. And in the red corner, from Phoenix, Arizona, he's 29 years old. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 191 pounds. He has a kickboxing record of six wins, one loss, and no draws, with four of his wins by knockout. He is the ISKA's number five world-ranked heavyweight contender. Please welcome Dino Holmesy. Holmesy. Once again, the third man in the ring, referee Ronnie Mestis. And Ron Mestis will uh, go to the corners, check the gloves, and if you saw Dino Holmes, he coming to the ring. He had a tux on as nice center. as yours, John. Almost as nice as mine. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Now we'll get the instructions from referee Ronnie Mastis. We say break, we break clean. If anything besides the fighter's feet touch the ground, you must stop the attack. Let's have a good, clean fight. Good luck to both of you, gentlemen. Right here. Right here. Paul. Bow and fight is next. Right both men chasing the same world champion in the course. Fighter, chase me. He's the cruiserweight Bow. and the heavyweight Face champion. Face each other. Bow. Ready? Dino yeah. Holmesy, on the right of your screen, he's the taller fighter by four inches. Paul Madison on the attack right now. Both men short. Ball at technique. Right hand by Holmesy over the top. Flush on the jaw. Holmesy's looking impressive. That, that breach advantage might really turn out to be a big advantage for him, although takes with 17, right knockouts, 17 knockouts to his credit, Paul Madison knows how to put him to sleep. Madison is a cool customer. A slip as Madison went up in the air and lost his balance. Madison, a cool customer. He was hit right off the bat, but you can't see it in his eyes. He looks totally unruffled. He's still attacking Holmes. He takes a left hand. Madison slips down. Take down. You know, Madison is a more natural cruiserweight. That's the division in which he's ranked. He came in here because he wanted to show that he can fight as a heavyweight He'd like a shot at Dennis Alexio. That's his goal, as, of course, is uh, Dino Holmesy. Holmesy so far mixing his attack between the body and the head. Holmesy lifts that leg up. No damage done. Madison closes. Left hook lands. Watch the holding. Watch the holding. Jump kick inside. Both men jump. That's something that you do not see real often. Is a jump front kick uh, out of a clinch like that. That's something that's very surprising. And Holmesy has, has caught Madison with it on two occasions already. It's a very unorthodox type of a technique, but he's had it successful. You know, Holmesy showing great agility for a heavyweight, 195 pounder, six foot three. When he knocked out Sal Narvez, local hero in Laredo, Texas, he used the jump spinning back. Now Madison getting the better of the exchanges inside. Holmesy might better want to use his reach, John. The only mistake I can see so far that Holmesy might be making is that he is carrying his hands low. Madison hits real hard. Madison gets in there and gets a good shot on the chin. Holmesy might be in for a short evening. Holmesy right hand up, glancing off the forehead. Watch the holding, watch the holding. They're being awful careful with each other early. They're big men and they hit hard. They both have a good knockout record, a left and a right. Break! Watch that.